The Deck Network. Build a deck. Bam! This is The Deck Network. I'm your host, Mike Danzilio, and we have the Loose Cannon. I'm here, Matt Dalton, the co-host. Remember, Deck Network, it's all decks, all the times. Okay, Matt, is another... All the times? Yeah, well... I'm messing up my own catchphrase here. Okay. It's been a long day, we've been busy, we've been drinking a ton of hot cocoa. Yep. You know what I mean? And we've got a big show today. Today's show is all about timber tech railings and earlier we mentioned on the uh, the deck network that timber tech and azac have merged and so they're trying to figure out how they're going to keep all these tremendous rails that they have so for, for just for today we're going to go with just the timber tech line of rails he may talk a little bit about azac in the video but that's what he does and Brought to you by our good friend Jason Duval. He's the video guy, right? He's the video guy. If you are looking on the Timber Tech website and you want to see any of these installation videos, that's the gentleman you'll see. This will be interesting to watch. You're a video guy. He's a video guy. Dig in the pink shirt, by the way. Spring. It looks good. Yeah. You got to keep spring in mind here. All right, so let's take a look at this video. I mean, this is the uh, the Timber Tech website. I mean, you can find out anything you'd want from the website. It's but all there for you. Let's jump into the Timber Tech video that I took when I was in Las Vegas at the International Builders Show. Yeah, that was a fun time. I had a great time oh, when I got invited. It was invited a great time. I, we had I went great with you. Food. We hit yeah. the casinos and lobster and steak. No, I was here. I was locked in the Deck Network studios waiting for him to come back with the footage. If you bring me out with you onto the road, I can help more, man. I'm the co-host. We're going to be hearing this one for the next few months, that's for sure. It's a sore subject. All right, so let's get right into the video. From Las Vegas, Let's Matt. Do did it. I see you there? Yeah, no. no this okay. Is as close to Vegas as I'm ever gonna get. Okay, on to the video. Boom. Hi, we're with Jason Duvall from TimberTech and Azac Company. Great to see you, Great Jason. You he is the man behind all of the installation videos on the TimberTech website. So, if you recognize them, you'll see them all over the place. Jason, we're gonna take uh, today. We want to take a look at TimberTech and Azac railing. Absolutely. Okay. So let's uh, let's start with uh, what we have right here. Yeah. So this uh, on this railing section we have radiance rail with our cable rail system. Uh, we developed uh, a cable rail system with Feeney, developed specifically for use with composite railing. And one of the new features we have this year is this cable rail system works with both the radiance rail system, evolutions rail on the timber tech side and then all three of the AZEC railing systems, so Premier, Trademark, and Reserve. Okay, we all know that they, the, the AZEC company and the TimberTech company are now one. So we have all of these products all available through one retailer or distributor. Absolutely. Okay, so, of course, we love this, everyone. Beautiful railing, great around the ocean. Maybe a little more expensive, but man, is it nice, because you wouldn't want to use glass Glass gets dirty, salt spray, you'll be out there cleaning that every day. Yep, and this is all 316 stainless steel. And the great feature of our cable rail system is the, the hanger bolt and quick connect system that keeps all the connections very clean, hidden, and puts all the tension of the cable on the 4x4, four four, which is a real, real, real great feature for use with composite railing. Okay, we're also right here, we have the AZAC bench. It comes in a kit and you just use your decking on it. Good way to get rid of some scraps. Absolutely. Okay. A great great added feature to yeah, so it. It looks really nice. So let's go right all the way around this beautiful display that we have. Come on over here. This is just our yeah, this this is our this is our radiance rail system with white composite balusters. Uh, one of the new things I'll, I'll mention on the lighting side is all of our lighting or most of our lighting features are now going to be dual branded for use with both Azec and TimberTech railing. You'll see on these white accent lights, um, they're for use with both Azec and TimberTech. All right, let's move right around see if we find anything a little different. So on this railing system, you actually have our brand new color Kona, which is an upgrade from the traditional walnut color. You'll see a little bit of more of a smooth finish to it, uh, a great upgrade for this year. And that Kona is the same color for both Radiance Rail and the Premier Azec railing system. Okay, what do we have here? This is our Evolutions rail system. We launched this last year. It's it's uh, unique in that it's all an over-the-post system with a very contemporary design. For the infill options here, we have the aluminum baluster. We offer it in both square 
and round. And uh, the unique feature with this aluminum baluster is it has a screw chase that runs all the way the length of the baluster to, to allow a really secure connection between that top rail and the bottom rail. A really unique product. This, by the way, is Matt's favorite rail. He, he likes to put his drink on top. So this is this is we have the Azex six by six post strap with a lot of the uh, the custom molding features offered by Azex to to create some great decorative features on this column. Also on this column, you'll see that dual branded accent light in in white. Also this ac this light's offered in in an architectural bronze as well. A lot of times people will ask me, well, what does it come with? Is it flat? Yes, these this this particular one is the six by six. And you can do all this beautiful carpentry work with it, with the just the moldings. So you can get attain this beautiful look any way you'd like. Okay. What do we got? What do we have over here? Here we have the the great new Azek Premier railing, and the big upgrade we made this year is we changed the design so it's installed in the same manner as Radiance Rail, all hidden fasteners and a really simple, easy installation. Uh, this is the Premier design. Uh, you'll notice uh, a flat top rail. There's also the trademark with a curved top rail that we'll, we'll show just a bit later. And uh, also on the post sleeve, we have a brand new post sleeve. It's five and a half inches wide to allow for 45 degree angles on the top rails without overhanging or bird's mouthing the top rail. All right, we're gonna we're gonna wrap this up with one of our favorite products. Yeah, this is our index storage kit that allows you a, a, have a great place to, to store any of the things you want to uh, hide on your deck surface. Here we have, we have cushions in here, a cooler, whatever you want to keep inside the deck. A great product with these uh, uh, gas-filled springs to allow easy opening and close of the storage kit. All right, Jason, that wraps us up for our TimberTech and Azac railing. Keep up the good work on the videos. Great job. Thanks, Mike. Okay. Appreciate it. Okay, Matt, that was our little video. Good stuff. Now, I love the cable stuff. rail. Looks good. The cable rail is real nice. Let's get, um, I have some photos. Now, just to be clear, Mike, when we're talking about railing, let's say the deck, the body of the deck, I'm using Trex. Am I going with Trex railing 100% of the time, or are you mixing and matching the different brands when it comes to the, the decking as compared to the railing and, and all that? That is what is called in the industry the attachment rate, and okay. of course, all the decking companies, Trex, Timber Tech, Fiber on Azac, would prefer a 100% attachment sure. rate, yeah. but it's only about 30% of the decks that are built have a the same decking brand as the railing brand. Okay. They go together. In some cases, you need to use the same brand because you want the same color. If you want a monochromatic deck and rail, then you're going to want to get, say, for instance, the Trex gravel path decking with the gravel path railing if that matches a full gray house and that, that's exactly what you want to do. But you can mix and match them. We see people do it all the time. Variety is a spice of life. So Timber Tech has a great railing line. As we saw in the video, we have the cable rail. It does look sharp. Yes. And um, this is a picture of a deck that Steve from Easy Decks did. Beautiful. Right in the ocean. And if you can use glass. The salt spray is going to just get it so dirty you can't even see through. You got to be clean. The stainless steel rail may cost a little bit, maybe 10% more than the glass does, but it looks like that. It's 316 stainless. That deck looks like it was featured on an episode of Show Us Your Deck. Absolutely was. Go back and check those old videos out. We yep. show off all this sorts is a great of deck decks. Steve from Easy Deck decks built this deck. I invented that bit here. Remember that. That's my baby. Yeah, it was just show Us Your thing. Deck. Yep. I get a nickel every time someone says that word. So, <laughs> all right. This is the standard white radiance rail. This is another deck from Steve from Easy Decks did. He built this one a few years ago in Dix Hills, New York. Steve, Beautiful. A big fan of the show here. Yeah, well, he, he, loves does, he likes building decks, and he does we like decks, so we kind of get along pretty well. Steve's a great guy. Here is a, the Black Radiance Rail. Okay. That is very popular. It matches a lot of the deckings. Six, seven years ago, if you asked me how much Black Rail I was going to sell, I'd, I would say none, if any. Uh -huh. But uh, I was wrong. Well, I'm sure as styles evolve over time, yeah. you know, it comes we in and out of popularity. Of black rails. We hit that. Timber Tech has a product called Harbor Stone Decking, which is a medium gray with some black streaking or variegations in it. And that with the black radiance rail, 
outstanding. Pops. Yes, it certainly does. This is um, our one of our showroom areas here, right outside the Deck Network. Oh, this is great. This is a peek into the headquarters here, right at the Deck Network. Yes. Have you ever wondered what the grounds look like? This is a, a decking campus. Yes. Okay, so there's <laughs> lots of different you think places. Apple to go. has a nice campus. You think Google has, a, has the grounds? This is what it is for decking, and guys. They're uh, they're jealous of us. So check out yeah, what okay. we got here. This so, is a great display. Okay, area. so this this rail has the black metal balusters. We last year 2013 we probably sold as many black round balusters as we sold square balusters. Reason being is you can see right through that. You're not when you look at that picture, you don't see the balusters. You see the the, the fire pit behind and the it, bend. the fire pit and what's behind it. So you get an illusion that you see right through it. So that is an excellent choice for a railing for anybody where you want to be able to see through it if you're on the water because it goes both ways if you're looking out from the deck you don't want it to impede your view mm -hmm. okay here's another one from uh, that deck that steve built over in belmore new york right. here's another one that steve built this is uh with the white radiant sleeve cap skirt post cap module and it also has the uh the the traditional walnut railing with of course a nice little curve on it Nice deck. Steve's building a ton of good-looking decks. Does the uh, guy ever take time off? It seems like he's always putting decks up. He I takes mean, the winter off. He's <laughs> hanging around his house playing with his kids and his dog. And not he's, bad. He's yeah, busy he's, yeah well, he's always doing that type of stuff. Here's one of my personal favorite decks. This is right outside why. the Deck Network studio. Right here. If you, if, 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 if if you it's about 25 feet from where we're standing right now. It's covered in snow today. But... And if you pan to the left a little bit, you'll see Mike's prime parking space, which is right in front of the Deck Network Studios. <laughs> Mine, about a quarter of a mile away. Did we got to talk about that, too. Did you take they don't the, plow it the out. little uh, golf cart over here? Yeah, you know, yeah. you know, we took that, of course. There's a picture efficient. looking down this curved stairs. It's great. That's it's a great one of my deal. personal favorites. Now, that is white radiance rail with the traditional walnut baluster. As Jason said in the video, they've changed the color from the with the merger of the Azac and the Timber Tech line, it's the same color, but it has a little different finish on it. So uh, and look at those details on those stairs with the slight the curve to it. And well, that took a little bit of time. We may do a show on how to build one of those, but we got a lot of requests for for mm -hmm. those sorts of shows, and we mm -hmm. get a ton of requests. Hey, listen, if you've emailed us with a request for a show and we haven't been able to do it yet, hang in there. Mm -hmm. We will get there. We're inundated with emails and calls. <laughs> Uh, from people. We're so busy we, around the uh, the deck network. You know area. the show Duck Dynasty? Well, this is a deck dynasty. It certainly is. So right, here's another one. On a, uh, it's the uh, this one's called the gray or the slate colored Timber Tech Naturals decking with the white radiance with the, of course the light. We've got the lighting in there. Modules on there. Oh, those solar powered? Are you hitting no, a switch for those? Those bad boys? are. Uh, they're wired in there. They're hardwired. Those wired are hardwired. Those are low voltage LED. I have a show in the hopper all ready to go. We don't want to show you the secret sauce, yeah. but there's something. We got a, a ton of writers that are working yeah. on the show right now <laughs> talking about, well, the, about the lights and how it is. And it's uh, it's 12 volt LED. And uh, great, fascinating story with one of my favorite. Uh, Inventors of all time, Nikolai Tesla came up with AC power, and Thomas Edison came up with DC power. Oh, like the band, AC yeah, DC, yeah, same sort sure. of deal. So they were fighting each other over a hundred years ago, and uh, all right, well that's it. We don't want to do check out the History Channel, or maybe even the Science Channel, Titans of Industry, if you want to see more about that. But Matt, let's uh, before we get to this last picture, let's take a look. Well, let's look at this picture right now, and we'll keep it up here. This is the Evolutions Rail that uh, we saw in the video. With nice. Matt's, this is Matt's favorite rail. That's got the drink rail on it's there. You sure can kind of rest it right on there. Okay, so let's take a look at look at some of these railings up close. This is the. You'll see uh, what I mean here with this sort of rail. This is the Timber Tech Radiance rail. I think this is an antique white, and it looks like we have just a white cap on Little top. Cap. But it's everyone is always like this. It has a nice finish on it. Very strong. Looks great. But the only issue is, let's say you have your favorite coffee or even adult beverage. Yes. You're trying to hang out on your deck and you can't really you see there's not <laughs> much room to rest in. Yeah. Okay, So could we talk to the people there, the manufacturer? Get a cup holder installed in there. Yeah, you Long can get thing. those little hook things. Yeah, out. something. You have them all have over to... inside your car, I'm yeah, sure. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, so this is the Timber Tech Radiance Rail. 
No visible hardware. It's way locked up inside here. If you see all these different channels, it's a four-piece rail, top and bottom. It has uh, an extra part. That's how they get the hardware in there. But uh, yeah, the Radiance seeing... rail, very, very nice. My best-selling rail. Little on the pricey side, but anything of quality certainly is. TimberTech knows that, so they came up with a less expensive version of their rail called the TimberTech Radiance Rail Express, which we have right here in black. So what's the difference now it, okay. from this to that? The main difference is the sleeve. It's small. This is a 4x4 four four sleeve as opposed to the 5x5. Five five. This one's a little more stripped down. doesn't have the nice bead on the corner here. I'm seeing hardware on the inside. Yeah, you see a little bit of hardware. And the, here's the thing about railings. The less you pay for a rail, the more hardware you're going to see. And conversely, the more you pay, the less hardware you're going to see. To the point where you won't even so see any hardware. That's a trade-off that you're going to get, but it has the same finish on it. It's the same colors. Same way that you can't really rest yep. your drink on there, yep. but I guess, you know. But it's a nice rail. Let's they have a, a light that fits in this. That would be the 4-inch light. The 5-inch light fits on the radiance rail and, and the five and a half inch light fits on the azac rail and that's housed in the cap it, well the cap fits it fits inside here and the, and the, the cap, cap pops on top. clips on top of that okay like a sandwich almost if you will yes like a ham sandwich ham on rye my ham favorite rye. sandwich we got a huge craft service table right outside the camera view all sorts okay, of okay so this photo here is the this is the evolutions rail this is a cap composite rail it comes in the three colors the brick the, uh, the the brick, the black, and it must be the walnut colored rail. Mm -hmm. But uh, looks good. It's it's more for the West Coast people. It's it's less rail. It's really a thin rail. There's, there's not a lot of lot to it. But from this photo, it looks like it's a bulky rail because it has the the six inch top flat piece. So Matt certainly in his inebriated state, he can certainly put a, a adult cocktail beverage on, on top of it and not have it fall off, but it still could fall off. But. And you make a great point, but seeing it on the photo doesn't fully represent the scale mm -hmm. of the rail. That's why it's important that you do, you watch the videos, you get the information, but then you get out there and you touch and you feel some of the product before you go out and make that final decision. Okay, TimberTech Rail, one of my favorites. Great company. And uh, if you want to see these, you can go to TimberTech.com, take a look at their rails. You can go also to the Go to Deck Network, of Deck course. Deck Network. If you want to purchase any of these products, you can always go to the Deck Network store. And hey, people always say, explain this stuff to me because it's very confusing. We know it's confusing. And at the Deck Network, we can take some of that confusion out of purchasing a deck. So you could actually come and buy it from Matt and I, and you'll be all set. We'll, we'll take the liver up and down the eastern sea seaboard. Plus, we'll make you laugh in the process. Yeah. A little bit. And not your average deck dealer. And you'll dealers. know that we can that you got a deck from the Deck Network. So that's it for today's show. If you want to contact us, Mike at the Deck Network, Matt at the Deck Network, like us on Facebook. Find the Deck Network there. You'll see all the archives of the old show us your decks plus all the videos you need to watch. They're mounting. There's a lot. There's a lot of content. There's a lot okay, of information. Okay, folks. Ciao for now. See you next time. As he crinkles the paper, I'm saying bye, folks. He's hitting the camera. B to B to B. That's all, folks. Bye now. Take care.